I do all the weight training. I go in there very seriously. I don't clown around or anything. And nothing changes. And you've been doing it for years. I got a gut. I seen you with your shirt off in concert. You don't well, have you don't well, have an maybe, ounce of fat. Well, maybe you you uh, do you look at your diet? Yes, I cut down on the carbohydrates. What do you eat for breakfast? I'm curious. Usually a Metrex bar. That's uh, it. That's it. Yeah, but you're a big guy. What do you weigh? Two hundred what? Uh, one ninety. One ninety. One ninety five. And you're telling me you c- you're not hungry after a Metrex bar? Yeah, I am. But then I eat a few hours later. I try and eat like small meals all through the day instead of any big meal at any time. Please take me through a typical day of what you eat. I'm being serious. I need to know. All right. Uh, let's see. Wake up in the morning, and uh, do a Metrex, and then uh, usually, if I can get a fruit salad or a yogurt, something like that, and then something till usually lunch if I. Like if I'm home in L.A., uh, it's a can of tuna fish and a thing of fresh squeezed orange juice. No bread. No, I, I never I never buy bread in the store. No pasta. No, nope, too lazy to cook it. All right, can of tuna fish for lunch, something like that, and then you eat a snack and before dinner. Juice. Yeah, uh, well, the, so I yeah, that that's a good lunch meal for me. Uh, the, the tuna and the orange juice because you get lean carbohydrates, lean protein, and it does make you fall asleep by 2 in the afternoon. And then uh, usually there's uh, some kind of pre-workout meal, like a, like a Metrex, something, you know, Metrex protein shake. And then I hit the workout, and then I'll eat, uh, you know, soup and a sandwich. How long or, is the workout? Know, whatever. A soup and a sandwich, a turkey sandwich or something like that. Usually just the soup, soup and maybe a handful of blue corn tortilla chips. And that and is that before or after the workout? After the That's workout, after? two hours later. Dinner. Okay. All right, I don't understand something. You're not starving. I mean, you're starving yourself. True? No, no, I'm never hungry. You feel you feel satisfied from just what you explained to me. Yeah, it's also your metabolism too. You know, maybe yeah. you, you just have your your metabolism. You should have a diet that is more on for your metabolism. You should. Uh, See somebody and they'll I am. I'm seeing up. somebody. Do, does he run? Taryn Carpenter ate more than Henry, and I Henry's know. got packed died. dense muscle. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I don't get it. I cannot figure this whole thing but out. Does he run or something? Do you run? Yeah. No. I, uh, for me, aerobics is band practice because we go in there and hit it real hard I in a small you guys, room, and you, you know the practices go pretty long, especially before a tour. We're in there like a solid month. Like it's a gig. You know, yeah, we play I, longer than normal shows, actually. Yeah, I've seen you on stage. Your stamina is incredible. But the only thing that you do in the gym is these weights. Yeah, I work out in my garage at home. I just have a bunch of weight in the garage, deadlift platform, and a, a, squat, a squat rack. And that's, and that's it, the basic exercises. Yeah, I do the three basic lifts. Well, the two basic lifts, uh, squat and deadlift. Bench for a lot of people isn't a real lift. But I, I bench and I do a lot of shoulder work, overhead work. Just like the, the, the caveman real deal you know simple push ups simple things yeah, yeah which is all you need really you don't need those fancy machines well, I am telling you I'm doing the same thing as Henry Rollins I'm sure doing it I swear to you I know you're looking at me and you're saying this can't be well, you don't look out of shape no I'm not out of shape but it's it's not pretty <laughs> it, it, it doesn't look like a guy who works out